This video is not financial advice. I'm not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer, baby. The one and only ape father in the bathroom. Wow! You know, this ape just writes a comment that kind of like pissed me off, all right? So I had to respond to it. I think his name was something, Joe H. I don't know. <laughs> I saw it so quick. He goes, let me ask you a question. He says, right? How, why is it okay when you make videos, is what he says, and you ask you know, your audience, your viewers, for their opinions on things, but then you criticize Uncle Festa, you criticize Lou when he does the same. It's a very, very simple, very simple answer. And I, everybody's probably laughing already to themselves because they know what I'm going to say, right? You know what I'm going to say, baby. Listen to me. When do I say that I have secret connections? Never, right? When do I say I'm meeting hedge funds in the park and they're giving me insider tips, right? on exactly when AMC is going to squeeze, on, you know, what's happening inside, right? When do I say that any of those things? I don't say it, right? I don't say I have secret connections. You know who says that? Lou! Uncle Festa says that. So my point is that if you're going to claim that you got secret connections, if you're going to claim that you're meeting with hedge funds in the park and they're giving you all this uh, insider tips and you're relaying that information that you're getting from them to us, then you shouldn't be asking us for, for our opinion because you already got all the answers, correct? You already got the crystal ball. You already got the secret connections. What do you need us for, <laughs> all right? What do you need our opinions for when you already got the, the, the winning lottery ticket, right? Like, let me ask you a question. Hypothetical situation. Hypothetical situation. I'm hanging out. I'm at a bar. I'm drinking a beer, right? Next to me, there's a psychic. Like, and let's say she's 100% on the level for real. She's got a psychic. And then on the other side to me, I got a drunken guy who's called uh, Lou. That's his name, right? He's got a bald head. He's, he's drunk. He's drinking like 10 shots of Jameson, all right? Who am I going to listen to, all right? Am I going to listen to the drunken buffoon or am I going to listen to the psychic who gives me the, the numbers for the mega tonight? I'm going to listen to the psychic. That's the way Uncle F Festa presents himself. He doesn't present himself like a drunken bum with a bald head. He presents himself like he's got a crystal ball. He's got all the answers. He's got secret connections. He's turning down tens of millions from corrupt banks. He's turning down 20000 a month from sponsorships where it looks like a, a, a five-year-old kid wrote up the contract. Right. <laughs> Remember what he posted? It looked like it looked like a five-year-old kid wrote a post saying, "I'd like to offer you twenty thousand dollars." That's how that's how unprofessional it looked. Listen to me. The guy is a pathological liar. Yet he still gets twenty, thirty thousand views a video. So maybe I should do the same thing, right? AMC to Pluto.